The Independent National Electoral Commission, INEC, says it has reviewed the functionality of the bimodal voter accreditation system, BIVAS, following the complaint received after the recent area council elections in Federal Capital Territory in February 2022. The chairman of INEC, Professor Mahmoud Yakubu, made this known at the second quarterly meeting with media executives at the commission's headquarters in Abuja. He said 14 days after the FCT elections, the commission conducted six by-elections in four states across four geopolitical zones of the country, covering rural, suburban and urban areas. The INEC boss added that the re-enacted electoral act will be part of the discussion at the meeting. One of such provisions is the electronic transmission of election result. At this meeting, we will discuss the implementation of the provisions of section 60, 62 and 64 of the electoral act regarding the management of election results. We have prepared a document for discussion, which is included in your folders for this meeting. On his part, the president of Nigerian Union of Journalists, Comrade Chris Iziguzu, advised the commission not to bow to pressure from political parties. All of us must team up to defeat this common enemy, and not by writing reports, churning out reports that would destroy the entire system. It will not help anybody. He, however, assured INEC that the media will work with all the security agencies to ensure the success of the 2023 general elections. CNN News.